Hello everyone, I'm Deb with Cooking with Mo and Deb, and I am making a really quick and easy um, dessert today. And it is five ingredients, and that's all I'm that's all it takes. One is an angel food cake, which I'm just going to cut into bite-sized pieces. I'm kind of cutting it into thirds, and then I'm gonna cut it in just bite-sized pieces. Um, I bought this angel food cake, but you could make your own. It would actually be cheaper to make one. I just was short on time, so I went ahead and bought it. Just buy a, a box of angel food cake mix if you want to make one yourself. It's just cake mix and mixed with water, and you'd bake it. So very easy. So if you're not pressed for time, that would be what I would suggest. And then I'm going to cut this cake like this. And just get, and another thing to do is to prepare your items ahead of time. That makes it even quicker. So all this takes is some strawberries, which I've washed and uh, cut up into a quarter to each berry. And a cup of blueberries, one cup of strawberries and one cup of blueberries. And one angel food cake and one 16 ounce cup of Cool Whip or Whip Topping and a pretty bowl like a trifle dish or uh, any kind of pretty bowl. I like a glass bowl but you can use whatever you want. So for the base of your cake or your trifle or in the bottom of your bowl add your angel food cake pieces and just fill it up so there's plenty down there in the bottom of the Plenty of cake in the bottom of it. We're going to put this whole cake in two here, uh, the bowl eventually. So we're going to make about three layers. So I'm going to go ahead and get a good little bit, about a third of my cake into my bowl. Um, then we're going to add some, about a third of the strawberries. And a third of the blueberries. And when, like I said, when you go ahead and prep all your ingredients, it goes even quicker. Now, the Cool Whip, I was, I'm adding some coconut extract. I wanted almond extract, but it looks like I'm out of it. So I am using coconut instead. So I'm just going to mix this up right here in this, in this bowl. And yes, this is the large 16 ounce, or you could get two small, uh, eight ounce bowls. Um, you could, I use the original, this is the original, you could use the light Cool Whip if you wanted to. So let's go ahead and add about a third of the Cool Whip mixture. And I wanna try to get this spread to the, all the way to the edge of my bowl because I'd like to see the layers in here. It just makes it pretty. Get just a little more cool whip in this layer right here. And it seems like it's gonna fill up pretty fast, so, cause I've still got, it may just be two layers. <laughs> All right, so some more cake. I am, I've cut these, but I'm kind of tearing them into a little bit smaller bites. And we're just layering each one of these ingredients. You could use other fruit in this if you wanted to, like, Pineapple would be really good. Kiwi would be really good. I think I'm just gonna make two layers here. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna put some more strawberries right here on top. I'm gonna save a few to put on the top for a little bit of a decoration. I'll put in some more blueberries. I love strawberries and blueberries together. You can see how it's kind of coming together. So let's add some more Cool Whip. So the size of your bowl is going to help you determine about how much cake or how many layers that you're going to make. 
And I'm gonna end with two layers because I wanna put some of the berries just on the top of this Cool Whip as the topping. So I think we've got some, you know, this is just a light, very light dessert. A great for a summer day. And we're gonna refrigerate it. You need to refrigerate it two to four hours before you eat it. Put some more blueberries on top here. And we're done. Look how quick that was. There we go. Blueberry and strawberry trifle with angel food cake. See how pretty it looks, how yummy it looks, doesn't it? Taking this to my mom's house for Mother's Day and can't wait to see what everybody thinks. Thanks so much, y'all. Have a great Mother's Day.